Hey everybody, welcome back to the hillside. Um, today I'm going to show you something that maybe you don't know about peanuts. Alright, so what you see in front of you is a peanut plant with this little beautiful little yellow flower. Okay, so these plants will then self-fertilize themselves. So they're going to get fertilized and then what's going to happen is they are going to peg. Okay, so if you don't know what that is, check it out an example right here. Okay, now see right here in front of these two um, shoots basically coming down look like aerial roots okay well this is actually not true these are actually the swollen ovaries of the flower now what they're gonna do is they're gonna descend from the plant right here like you see and it's gonna go under the ground right in here you see where it's kind of right there where it's kind of touching the ground well that's actually what's gonna go under the ground and that's what's gonna form the peanut underneath now you can see one right here right there where it's still kind of working its way down, but yeah, it's like makes a little short little peg, as they're called, and it's going to go into the ground and form your peanuts. So a lot of people may not know that it's very, uh, it's not very common in the plant kingdom for uh, this type of reproduction because you know, in, in hindsight, you know, it's peanuts are trying to produce seeds for for reproduction. So uh, I don't know the the Latin name for this or the scientific name. I'll have to look it up. Maybe I'll post it down in the comments below or something. Uh, what the actual name of it is, but yeah, so if you've never grown peanuts and like I said, I don't I don't expect to have a giant crop I have I have a raised bed full of up at the uh, up on top of the garden there I got a couple peanuts I stuck in here amongst the uh, the pepper plants just kind of just as an experiment just for fun But that's how they look if you've ever ever seen a peanut plant grow or I should say if you've never seen one grow that's what I was trying to say But yeah as I'm over here getting uh, devoured by some mosquitoes here this evening I thought I'd like to just give you a quick little update kind of show you that show the neat little trick that peanuts use to reproduce and uh, I just noticed this here. Let me show you this real quick that that is not a peanut plant Okay, that is a hot pepper seedling that must have been a volunteer from last year because this is where I grew my hot peppers last year. I'm like, that doesn't look like a, a peanut leaf. So there you go. But uh, like I mentioned to everyone before, I always like to tell you to get close up in person with your plants because there's another little peg right there. You can kind of see a little bit of the, the dead flower on the end of it right there. But you never know what you're going to see, okay? Um, you know, if you've never grown peanuts, you've, you would never have known how they uh, reproduce like this. It's pretty cool, right? So, I mean... Always get out there, examine your plants up close and personal, and I will, uh, I'll do more of a compilation video, kind of a seed to a harvest when the peanuts are completely ripe, but I wanted to show that out there for anyone who maybe just was curious about this, uh, this process or just to uh, see something new along the way. So I do, uh, thank you guys for watching here at the hillside and I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye.